Hello everyone and welcome to Rudy Root with Jeff. Today we will be doing the root arachnid, meaning spider. So let's jump into it. So here's what my trusty trusty sidekick, the Merriam-Webster Dictionary, has to say about arachnid or arachno. It's a combining form and it's etymology, New Latin and Greek, and it means spider. And an example word, arachnology, or it means arachnoid membrane, but we, we're going to be covering this, the number one definition. And here's a picture of Spider-Man, since we're talking about spiders. And I actually picked this route because Spider-Man Homecoming came out a few days ago. So... Since we've covered the root, let's talk about some examples. The examples are arachnophagus, arachnophobia, arachnian, arachnoid. So, the first word is arachnophagus, and it means feeding on spiders. And its etymology is arachna plus phagus. Phagus means like feeding on, so it makes it makes sense because arachna it means spider, so it means feeding on spiders. And the second word, I'm pretty sure you're all familiar with it, arachnophobia, and it's a pathological fear or loathing of spiders, and it's arachna plus phobia, phobia meaning fear, so it's a fear of spiders. So the next two words, arachnian, it means having the lightness or fineness of texture of a spider's web, gossamer. So, n means other belonging to, but we want the second definition, which is characteristic of. Because having the lightness or fineness, and those are characteristics of a spider web. And the second definition is gossamer. And it means a fine, filmy substance consisting of fragments or strands of cobweb. And spider webs are kind of gossamer. And it means infinitely, it also means infinitely or exquisitively light, delicate or tenuous. And that's also something that spider webs are. So the next word, arachnoid is a thin membrane of the brain and spinal cord that lies between the duramater and the pyomater. There's also another definition meaning resembling a spider's web. So for oid, something resembling a, or it's just oid, resembling. The difference is because is one, which means something resembling a specified object or having a specified quality, and the other one is resembling and having the form or appearance of. So, let's move on. So, here's something you probably don't want to do. You don't want to confuse a arachnid with a car because that's a bad idea and you might get a word wrong. Oh, definition of the word wrong because you're like oh yeah that means spider but it also but it means might so here's some words here's the root from my trusty trusty sidekick it means might it's from new latin and it's a there's a word acarian of or relating to the order of acarina and acaroid resembling a mite and acarology a branch of zoology that treats mites and ticks. So, moving on. Time for Roots in News. So, Arachnid in the News, Los Angeles Times, Arachnid Bitten, and Arachnid, that's our root today, and Arachnid is just another way to say spider. Arachnid, it's one of the arachnida, arachnida, and in here there is spider. In the definition, right after scorpion, it's spiders, and it's kind of funny because if you watch the movie, 
at the end there's a super villain with uh and his name is scorpion and i think he's gonna appear in the next movie so sorry i didn't give you a spoiler alert but i just couldn't help myself and so yeah and time for the bonus so let's get to the roots of arthropod arthropods are an, an invertebrate animal that has an exoskeleton and segmented body and jointed appendages and yeah so the root is arth meaning joint and pod meaning one having feet so basically joints are in the def definition jointed appendages and as you can see all of in the pictures all of them have some sort of like feet and usually they have more than two like us time for name the spider since we are talking about mites spiders no arthropods thought we could cover tarantula and yeah so tarantula in my trusty trusty sidekick the merriam-webster dictionary is a european wolf spider or any of various large hairy spiders of the family yeah but i'm actually kind of scared of tarantulas so yeah they're big so that's bad so that ends the video for today Time for my Rudy Root beer.